uh, generating more solar power. Okay, the sun's out. Let's see, what does it take? I wonder what it takes to charge, like what the minimum input is to charge one of these things. Minimum? No idea. The required input is 12 megawatts, but that's max. Yeah. I don't think there is a minimum, just if it's producing power, it'll take some. Well, I mean, as far as for recharging, I mean. I do not know. Something to study further. Yes. Permission to buy? But it's granted. Sure. Why did this one start with so much more power? Maybe the system pulled all of it out of this one first and then it. Oh, oh. maybe immediately when that one got charged up, it probably pulled a bunch of power because yeah. nothing was charging. Yeah. So it's, so it's not using a whole lot. Did you fin uh, can you finish the panel? Oh, yeah. Totally forgot about that. Doink. Ta-da. Not bad. Looking pretty good. Yeah. It's actually a decent little solar area there. Trying to offload my uh, stuff as fast as I can, but the refinery now is at maximum holding capacity. Hmm. So we will at some point now need a cargo container hooked into this collection, so right. I'll be able to do mass unloads. Okay, man. Give me a second, I will. Add one in, or at least try to. Where are you putting it? You're gonna just run off the side of the assembler here, because otherwise we'll have to tear out some cables. Uh, I mean, it makes sense. Just throw the storage in the rock. Yeah. All right. So probably you need to just drill it out, huh? Yeah. Yes, that's when they are releasing. Yay, grindy, grindy, grindy. That was very inaccurate. I just kind of went for it. The assembler is just going to town right now on steel plate. Mm. Kind of feels like uh, when we started up the base the first time. Yeah. Or in uh, season one, I mean. Mm. 
So I guess if that's the case, I'm just going to start welding. Yep. Did you put Minnie Mouse in bed with her? Attached to a blanket, it's a limit. That's what the word is. You can go in there and maybe the spider toy. No others as she wakes up and plays with them. Or rolls over them and wakes her up. Making a moon base. Yay, moon bases. my welding ship because I could just go along and get like three of these plates done at the same time yeah off um, conveyor belts. Uh, you need an actual conveyor junction. Oh. Yeah. So we'll have to, uh, you can build a block onto the side of connectors. So we'll have to build one connected to the frame or something, then break down one of the blocks and build a frame around it. So it's the same grid. That was an oversight. <laughs> um, 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 How are we going to be able to disconnect it and reconnect it? There's literally nothing there to connect this to. I mean, like, I I to hold it stationary. Oh, wait, hold on. I figured out how well I think we could do it. Hold on. To hold Watch. it stationary. Yeah, because it can literally. Just got to. Put this guy to the rock. Done. Bring it to the same frame, same grid at least. No, it's already on the same grid though, because it's currently all connected. Oh, there. Now we can break it and replace the block there without it. Okay. So, probably about here then? You think? Sure. Works for me. Okay. Well, I committed to it. So I'm going to need ten construction components, six interior plate, and eight small steel tube. I have, so you need six interior and eight small steel. Yep, and construction component. <coughs> no, I had the construction component. Okay. Actually, they're in the, it looks like the steel tube are in the assembler. Yep, I've been producing a lot of things. Alright, uh, then I'll just need them on that. You get in there. Oops, forgot to grab the plate. Ta da! 
Ta-da. Figure I'd work on sealing this off before we get too far. <laughs> I don't know if we can actually hold air with blocks like this through the rock, but it'd be kind of cool if you could. Don't know. I guess we'll find out. Maybe we will. Display a bunch more metal grid. I need hydrogen. I'm going to need hydrogen here in a second, too, actually. Play this half out. Let's not get stuck on the wrong side of that thing when I need hydrogen. <laughs> Bloop. Ba -doop, ba -doop. What the hell do I need? I need things. I need a display and much more. Like it here, I gotta rename it, but then it'll automatically pull any ore into itself, and only ore. So no funky routing. So if it's magic, if if it actually allows you to seal up against rock, that hole is plugged. All right. So I guess that'll be an experiment later when we get this thing filled in. <laughs> so I'm going to reclaim all this plate because otherwise I'm going to destroy it. Cargo container that automatically, a large cargo container that automatically pulls ores out, and the refinery is set to automatically, it will switch things around to process what, what material is needed most right at that moment. Sweet. Yes. Tim is a wonderful thing. Thanks, Tim. So, if it's working properly. The uh, mining ship should be empty. Should be, yeah. Which it is. Perfect. It's to unload. I was about to back away and start going to mining. I'm like, wait a minute, I know we got batteries, but. <laughs> <laughs> Not gonna test that limit quite yet. I'll say they're both about 75% charged. Besides, there's enough welding projects to do right now. Yeah. Try to get the hangar somewhat built more. That's exactly what I'm working on. I suppose we'll need hangar doors at some point if we're going to make this airtight. Yes. And also, we'll probably need to segregate this stuff off from the actual hangar portion. Yep. Worked when you're in gravity situations. 
right? Because then you could walk on the ceiling. Building, building, building. I guess that's the other thing we'll need is uh, an oxygen generator too if we're gonna start sealing the stuff off. Yep. But I guess we gotta seal it off first, so. Yeah, it's a <laughs> one project at a time. Yep. Do, 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 do. Shit picks up slower. <laughs> <laughs> yep. I need steel plate. Okay. So I've burned through fifteen hundred steel plate just like that. <laughs> It's a good thing our assembler is not working on steel plate anymore. You can bump that around. Six megawatt hours stored possible. What does a no. refinery use? No idea. It's totally base values there, no yeah. upgrades on it. Because I'm like, alright, if I break off. Are you all right, so you are you here at the moment at the Yep. Can you look at the batteries when I disconnect and see if they tell you how long they're gonna last? Let's see. Let's see. Stored power current output. Um, Ready? Go for it. What's it say? So fully depleted in five hours for one of them. Okay, so I can, well, if they're charged, I can actually go and do go stuff and, and, back and should basic have stuff enough. done. Yeah, that's good, actually. Because like, if we can get those, actually, if those two batteries can be charged during the sun, that should be enough to run during the dark. Currently, under our current power demands. Should be yes. Perfect. Okay, so, um, raw materials, we still need iron, right? Always. I mean, I kind of figured, but, you know, <laughs> worth asking, I suppose. Do we have storage right at this moment? So there's a the little burrow I was in earlier and I had iron, so... Yeah, iron and cobalt are our two lowest. Iron we have about 82,000. Cobalt we have about 8,000. Silicon and nickel we have over 150. 
thousand okay. of each. So I'm going iron hunting. That works. So we're gonna need a lot of that with all the steel plate and stuff. We're gonna oh yeah. Use it. Plus, I think you need it for hanging the doors. Plus, I think you need it for our engine generators. Plus, yeah. You need it for just about everything else. So. Pretty much. Actually, we're probably gonna have to call it here soon. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. We're gonna work tomorrow. Yes. But I figured I'd at least get another another load of iron going here. Mm -hmm. we'll continue to work on the floor till then. Looks like the game is telling me to get off anyway, as it keeps giving me a low sim speed on server. Seems like time's up. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Jumpy, jumpy. You're getting it too? Yep. Yeah, I'm starting to get some latency warnings now too. Fun. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's, let's get back in the ship now.
pain yeah, I'm having. Yeah, right. In space. I'm on the moon, actually. Well done. I don't know if those were meteors or stones flying away, because I just, no, I, I think you're pretty near, because I'm just seeing these stones randomly fly. Yeah, and not terribly far away. I think the sun's about to come back out, too. Yeah. Which means the base will be powered. Yes. Without the need of the ship. Oh boy. Yeah. I don't know if docking this is going to be a smart move or not. Hold on. Yeah. Stabilize. Okay. I turned the, thr the stone thrower off. That seemed to help. Yeah. There. All right. Coming in. Do, 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 do. Calm down. <laughs> I just, I just want to get docked. It'll be a lot safer for this ship once it's docked. <laughs> oh, does that mean we can have a tea party? Well, everybody loves tea party. <laughs> We are connected. Yeah. Alright. I guess I'll yeah. pop up on hydrogen and we'll head on up. I will meet you there. Bloop. Bloop, bloop. We made quite a decent amount of progress, though. Yeah. Another set of uh, solar panels, got an assembler going, we got some batteries, we got the conveyor system running. All good things. All good things for progress, that's for sure.
Hello. All right, so that's gonna do it for this episode. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, made some good progress. Now we're starting. It's kind of like season one all over again. We're, re we're kind of <laughs> rebuilding uh, the manufacturing we had. So we're, we're in the Iron Age again. <laughs> <laughs> now uh, just to get to the automated age. Mm -hmm. But uh, that's a good step because I think next uh, we'll get enough uh, iron so I can start uh, rebuilding Mega Miner properly. Because mm -hmm. then that'll help. Um, we'll get the large cargo container system set. Or wait, you already it's, built that. I built one of. Ideally, I want three. Right, but that's you know it's a work in progress. Yes, one of uh, the three is built. <laughs> so we can start mass offloads finally. Yes. Um, and then probably upgrade the refinery system a little bit. Get uh, the base yep. stabilized. Get a new solar system going up top. Yes. Then start working towards uh, the planet. Yeah. Yeah. Once once we get the moon base kind of self-sustaining. Mm -hmm. And that's the idea with the solar, so that way it's it's doesn't have to be babysat. It just powers itself. Yeah. Powers itself. You throw stuff in it, and then it figures itself out. And you can leave it for episodes at a time, and come back, and there'll be stuff up there when you get back. Yeah. But yeah, anyway, uh, that's going to do it. Um, next week, we'll be back at it again. With more yes, adventures and, and such. Yeah. So until then, guys, take it easy. And peace. Ah. Uh -huh.